Hi everyone and welcome to Bible Story Time. Today's story is The Loaves and Fishes. Hi everyone and welcome back. I'm so excited you're here. So like I said, today's story is all about the loaves and fishes. So let's listen to the story together. So let's all take a seat. And how do we always start our Bible story times here? We start with our song. So ready? Probably know it by now. Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you? How are you? Hi, hello, and how are you? How are you today? I hope you're having a wonderful day. So, like I said, our story today is the loaves and fishes. So let's see what happens during this story, shall we? Shall we? Can't talk today. Hopefully I can read better. <clears throat> Alice had a picture book with Bible stories in it. She looked at it whenever she had an extra minute. One day as Alice picnicked beneath a clump of trees, she read a Bible story from the book upon her knees. About some barley loaves and fishes was the story Alice read when the airmail bird dropped her a note and this is what it said. Reading is a special key that takes you where you want to be. The picture book that Alice held became a giant screen. She walked through to Bible land and came upon the scene. She saw Jesus and his disciples on the Sea of Galilee looking for a spot to stop and rest beside the sea. They wanted to have quiet and be all alone that day, but the followers of Jesus wouldn't let him get away. They followed Jesus by the shore, more people joined in too. They came from everywhere around. The crowd just grew and grew. Old men came and young men and young men came. And women came as well. Even children came to hear what Jesus had to tell. All those people People who were sick came, and the lame and the blind came too, hoping Jesus' healing touch would make them feel good as new. Listening to his teachers, teachings was such a special treat that almost everyone forgot to take some food to eat. So they were so excited, they forgot to pack lunches. Hmm. But one small boy remembered he packed a tasty dish of five small loaves of barley bread along with two small fish. Jesus came, kept on sailing on the Sea of Galilee while the crowd kept growing bigger on the shore along the sea. So there's a the little boy in the side and then there's Jesus in his boat finally Jesus found the place that he'd been looking for but he was not alone at all for a great crowd lined the shore 5,000 people came that day to listen to him talk and many came for healing, for they could barely walk. So 
So Jesus stayed there with the crowd he loved so very much. He healed the sick, the lame, and blind with his special healing touch. Then as he talked about God's love, the sun began to set. And Jesus realized no one there had eaten, su eaten supper yet. Oh, I forgot to show you those pictures. He turned to his disciples and asked them to buy bread, for his followers were hungry and needed to be fed. We haven't enough money to feed this crowd today, one, one disciple said to Jesus, so send them on their way. Oops, there's the camera. The young boy who had brought some food came forth and bravely said, I have some food, two small fish, and five small loaves of bread. Jesus had the crowd sit down and said a loving prayer to thank God for the bread and fish, and the boy gave him to share. There we go. We'll figure out the camera. Then Jesus broke the barley bread. He broke the fish up too. The more he broke, the more the food just grew and grew and grew. As Jesus broke the bread and fish, his disciples passed it out. The crowd saw quite a miracle. For this, there was no doubt. Hopefully you can see them okay. For two small fish and five small loaves of bread were passed along and made a filling supper for a crowd 5,000 strong. Not only was there food enough for each and every one, 12 baskets filled with food were left when everyone was done. And, G and all who saw the miracle that Jesus worked that day agreed God's promised Savior had at last come their way. The time had come for Alice to leave the Bible scene. She came back, she came back home by walking through her very special screen. Mm -hmm. Alice went back to her house and put, put her book away and thought, I've learned so very much in Bible land today. I saw Jesus heal those who hurt and teaching folks God's way and watch a boy who listened well share all he had that day. His meal was small and the crowd was big, but he was glad to give all he had to Jesus, who taught him how to live. I found out too the miracle that Jesus did that day. He showed he was the promised one who God had sent our way. And finally, I learned to put my trust in God above, for he provides for everyone, and he shares his endless love. So that's today's story. I hope you enjoyed it. 
Next are a couple of questions to talk about. So these are the questions to talk about with your family. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure to check the playlist for more videos. And as always, subscribe to our channel and hit the bell for notifications.